What's going on everybody? Look for the Indianapolis Colts to cover the four point spread this weekend on Sunday Night Football out there in San Francisco. Why? Well, I prefer the Colts quarterback situation right now. Carson Wentz, have you seen him in the last three weeks? Two touchdowns, no picks in each of the last three ball games. Okay, Indianapolis is a plus seven in turnover ratio this year. It's the third best mark in the league. San Francisco's a minus five. It's the third worst mark in the NFL. Jimmy Garoppolo's probably gonna come back from injury. He has not played since week four. San Francisco will not have George Kittle, which is a key piece, obviously, in that offense. Also, Robbie Gold is out, their kicker. A lot of wind action out there in San Francisco, so that can could, could really hurt San Francisco's uh, kicking game. Now, I know Indy's got their fair share of injuries also, man, especially on that offensive line, Quentin Nelson out and everything. But they've been trending upwards here, right? Last three ball games, they've, they, they've done well. They've been running the ball. Jonathan Taylor has been a key factor here in the Colts' recent success. They beat up on Miami. They should have beaten Baltimore in prime time, right? Lost in overtime, and they really beat up on Houston. So I just like the Colts, the, the way the Colts have been playing as of late. Also, I'm looking at trends, man. They're four and two against the spread on the year. They've, they've covered their last three games. And San Francisco as a home favorite has been a disaster the last few years. They've failed to cover in these situations their last seven games at home. Also, Kyle Shanahan as a home favorite, three, 14, and two against the spread. Four points is just too much for me right now. I like the way the Colts have been playing. And San Francisco, especially with Jimmy Garoppolo, right now, is just a bit of a question mark for me. So I'm taking the Colts plus the four. We shall see what happens. And for everything regarding the world of betting, you can go to oddshark.com. Bye-bye.